Hey guys, today we will be dealing with a very requested topic which is how to prepare for PT exams or the preliminary test exams. In judicial services exams, there are three stages as the PT exam, the mains exam and then the interview and PT is the first step. If you don't clear PT, no matter how much knowledge you have about case laws or how good you have a personality and you can do so well in the interview, if you don't clear the PT, you cannot get forward. So for PT, the preparation is a little bit different from what you do for mains even though you need to have the basic setup which you need to have for mains for PT it's basically MCQ questions which is a multiple choice questions that you will have to solve in the exam and for that the strategies require a little bit different that's what we're going to be discussing today and today's video we're going to be covering topics as follows we'll tell you how to prepare for different subjects like law GK, English, how do you prepare for these subjects for PT? We'll tell you how long to prepare for. How much time before the PT exam should you start preparing for the PT exam with PT strategies in mind? Then we will tell you how long before PT you should start revising. Furthermore, we're going to tell you where to do current and static GK for the PT exam. Then we're going to tell you what to do on the day of the PT exam to make sure that you get the highest marks possible and you clear the PT in the very first attempt. We're going to also tell you how to handle negative marking. This is one question which confounds most aspirants and we will tell you how to handle and go about negative marking. And also we're going to tell you how to finish the PT exam on time. First of all, it is imperative for you to understand that the PT exam is an objective exam and not a subjective exam. You will have two to two and a half hours depending on the state to do as many right questions as possible. So let's start with how to prepare for PT exams. The first question that students have is that for PT, should we do the entire law syllabus with case laws and citations or just concentrate on pair acts? The answer to that in short is yes.